Alright, what's up guys? Because as always, welcome back to an OE game versus Pato Black. And he brings the stuff. This is actually a really good team. Um <clears throat> I actually probably don't know how to beat this naturally. Um your Shifu is always pleasant. Um Wow, yeah. Like I'm struggling badly here. Mailman is not gonna help me a lot. Hmm. I don't think it's the worst idea to start off with Malekith. I only see like one matchup versus Venusaur that could be problematic. So we start off with that and see what happens. Also, don't really like Metagross. And depending on which variant it is of um, of your Shifu, it is Syrian Strike and it starts us off with that, then wow. <laughs> so anyway, Tupato, well, very much good luck, have fun, you know, the usual jazz and jam. Um, no, let's have a great game. That's really what we're all about. So, your Shifu. Don't be the waving guy. That's... That's a rapid strike variant. That's actually awful. Surging strike has never been freer. I'm gonna send in Cetrion anyway. I think I force... I force it out, but... It's not without a lot of damage onto me. And that sucks a lot, to be honest. Um, I think Surgeon Strike should do at least... Let's say 25% maybe? Oh, he died. Oh, wow. Alright, cool. That was... that was rather direct. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Hope it went for Hydro. Max Knuckle. Right, we'll start with this. Not with East, but we do. Um, <clears throat> yeah, this is not great. Um, do I have like an after, like a plan B after this? Guess Sloking kind of bring it on, but yeah, we're draining Kiss here. I hope whatever he can throw at me, I can recover. Keeps Max knuckling, which is good. But yeah, it starts to really hurt. Draining Kiss will do. Not as much as I wanted to. Not as much as I wanted to, but we definitely are in the clear. Um, question is whether or not I want to just stop him from doing whatever he does. Right? We max got in here. So he gets just not as much of his Dynamax as he, as he wants to. I really don't want a Dynamax myself, but as of right now, I'm just getting myself in a position where I'm going to lose a lot of HP in vain. And I'm not up for that. Super aggressive late from Pato. Um, so, yeah, G-Max Rapid Flow. It broke through. Of course it does. So now he's out of that Dynamax. So Surgeon Strike is probably his strongest hit. Um, and I'm pretty sure I am in a position where I absolutely kill him. So if I were him, I'd probably switch out. Yeah, like, <laughs> there we go. Makes sense. Probably to Metagross. To summon as much damage in there as possible. Um, Venusaur. Yeah, that's actually all right play too. Max Starfall it should do at least something, but definitely not enough. But consider my position, I take everything I can get. So, our class is kind of all right. Just scared out somewhat. Not properly, unfortunately. Mailman kind of scares him out too. 
Huh. I mean, Sludge Bomb is actually just a very fair play overall. So, yeah, we're doing this. Because I think Sludge Bomb makes sense, and it's going to do a whole lot of damage onto me. <sighs> not, not my best start, really. Sleep Powder. Yeah, like, there's a Mystic Rain here, buddy. That's not gonna work. Unless you're speedy, I'm pretty sure my Ice Punch will kill you. <laughs> I like that his flexes on me. <laughs> okay. So he is thinking here, which I get. What can he do to me? Can I stomach a hit and whatnot? I'll tell you right now, I'm not sure. I'm just very glad, yeah, he withdraws it. Fair, really, to Hatterini. And I mean, this is a neutral hit. How much would that do? Oh. You hate to see it. You hate to see it. But if he falls, then I'm screwed. <laughs> So <laughs> it's not like I'm staying in here. Um, we're not sending. No, he should. He should have mystical fire. Yeah, and that's like not the worst thing that could happen to me. <laughs> so we're doing that. Hmm. Malekif. Like mystical fire is the only thing that can kind of fall this out. Dazzling Gleam, that's unfortunate. But it's not like the end of the world. Um, glad I switched out at least. Let's see. Remaining mods. He has only one floater in Dragonite. Knockoff should do really good damage on any switch in. He does decide to stay in, and I'm pretty sure this kills the Hatterene with ease. Yeah. Yes, I can't get up Stealth Rocks however I want to. <laughs> and that's gonna be frustrating. I think Venusaur kinda comes in. Your Shifu. Fine. I've already seen U turn. I have to send in Cetrion. I have no other option. I think the play here is to bring. He has to bring Venusaur. He has the U-turn. If he's surging strike, then I'm pretty sure he gets himself in a worse position. U-turn, yeah. Like, 100% that's the play. I at least recover more from this than he can. But his only play should be Sludge Bomb. I don't enjoy Sludge Bomb at all. Honestly, there's a lot of things I don't enjoy. <laughs> Question is... Since we know he's somewhat bulky... I could send him Mikorith and get the really, really nasty stuff going. Plus one special defense should be helpful. I like sending in Mailman, but I don't enjoy the Sludge Bombs play either, even though it is resisted, so I am banking on this to save me. I just want to chip. So the special defense raise is gonna help me at least somewhat. Power Whip. Huh. So maybe he's gonna fall up with a Sludge Bomb? It actually did way more than I wanted to. Yeah, acrobatics. No reason setting up. To be honest, I kind of want to save my dynamics for this, but yeah, like there was no way I was going to get myself in the position. I'm just surprised he hasn't going for a poison move. Septile versus Venusaur, the old gen nemesis. I mean, nobody's counting Meganium after all, right? Stays in, connect acrobatics, 
And it's not a kill. It is not a kill. Power whips again. Huh. And yeah. Don't enjoy that. So I'm absolutely earthquaking here. I could fall with him, but I don't want to do it. <laughs> I want to save myself a little bit. Plus, I really don't want to deal with the Dragonite at all. I'm just happy I can break the Dragonite if I just go for it. And him losing Venusaur is gonna definitely make Tapu Fini a lot rougher to deal with. Though, then again, that's kind of the point for the both of us. I can always save Septa just for your Shifu. Unless it's Scarfed. He is thinking here. He is really thinking, do not like this situation, which I get. I'm just surprised we saw Power Whip and not Poison Jab. I couldn't favor. Oh, he switches out too. Oh, fuck me. Damn it. So this is the worst combo that could happen. Acrobatics here. If he dragon dances. Oh, he had E speed. Of course he has. I'm being dumb. Life orb. That's good though. That means no marvel skill for him. Um, I am not in the best position. I mean, arrows could kinda get in there. Our class definitely hurts him, but not kill him. Mailman could definitely kill him, but won't outspeed him. This is the worst type of situation I've ever been in. Um, <clears throat> I gotta do the art class play. Don't want to do it, but I have to do it. Because I need to get him down. And I mean really down. This is at least a matchup he like, doesn't enjoy. Oh, damage, fine. Rico. All right, so extreme speed and probably special. I'm gonna stomach this, but his combination is gonna be extreme speed, right? Oh, he dies, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> Got him. Had it been outraged though, we would have like locked him in a position where I really wanted him. So it's a damn shame. So let's see, his remaining Pokemons. Incineroar, Yoshifu, and Venusaur, and Metagross. Here comes the Metagross. Now depending on the Metagross set, um, I could be in very much trouble. The question is whether or not Bullet Punch can take me out, but Arrows is a natural switch into this. No matter what happens, I think I can stomach him. There's a reason to think this is a salt list. So far. Let's see. Ice punch. Yeah, it's fair. And we are not going to bother with that. So let's see. Venusaur is a switch in. How much HP did Venusaur have left? I wish I could see that. I'm fire blasting anyway. If Venusaur comes in, then so be it. To be honest, I really wanted to teleport, but I just I can't take the gamble. I really I cannot. I simply cannot. I'd rather fire blast than miss than um oh, I wish I knew which set this was. Venusaur was Skull a safe play? Probably, maybe, most likely, but he connects it, so it doesn't matter. Venusaur is gone, and um, now the fun begins. Now the fun begins. Maybe. I'm still not sure I can get this right. Um, 
Though um, I'm pretty sure um, U-turn your Shifu is going to be problematic. And that is, of course... I remember you. I'm so sure I remember you that I don't want to deal with you. Our class is kind of alright. As a side play, but so Malekith probably won't do anything great this time either. And he, he the safe play is U-turn, after all. So with that in mind, I mean, Slowking is still good versus everything here. I just, I want him to go for a knockoff and hopefully kill me. Darkest Lariats. That should probably kill too. So, I am in that weird position where I'm forcing him to go for... Ah, that's the thing. I either surf here and get Mailman right or I get Mailman in try to stomach that Fire Blast. Hope I missed the Dynamic Punch. I should probably outspeed this mon too, which just makes it worse. But if I connect it, I hope I kill him. This is weird. I don't know whether or not I'm, I wish that I missed this attack or not. But I think I do. He stays in. I connected, damn it! And it's probably gonna kill, by the way. Because it's, you know, it's this mon, which is just one of the best mons there is. So... Now I have two kind of weird situations. If Metagross come in, I have every reason to believe it comes in because it has to send headbutts, which could flinch me. But I also want to miss the attack. Because I go for high horsepower, which probably could kill... Yeah, I shoot out speed. I'm absolutely killing this guy. There is no way you take this, buddy. Oh, look, he did. <laughs> oh my god, it's Rocky Helmet. And he heads like, oh my god. No. No. <laughs> Fuck me. I was convincing myself it had... Uh, Damn it. So wait, what move did he have? I never saw any of these moves. We saw Ice Punch and we saw Psychic. You know what? I'm trying to wrap it up here. <sighs> should have just closed combat. No, I, you know what I should have done? I should have just done every punched again because that's what a mailman does. Oh, and he had a Protect. Exciting. And I can just lock myself into Thunderbolt and there shouldn't be a wrap up where he wins. I'm pretty sure about that. Unless that's Bullet Punch, which probably kills me. <laughs> oh, so it's not invested. It is definitely physically offensive. Damn shame, really, but that's Psychic coming out of nowhere. I'll say that. But the thing is, like, if you don't invest anything on Boss Wall's Special Defense, then things hurts for him. And a lot. So, for this matchup, there are, like, two things that will happen here. Either he has Aqua Jet, or he's Scarfed. That's the two things that can happen. So he's Scarfed. And that pretty much means... What does it mean, Chris? It means I send in Cetrion and just let her kiss this guy goodbye. <laughs> I swear, Tabu Fini is such a massive Pokemon this generation. Never been proud of using it because I think it's it's phenomenal in its own right. I just wish that um, it got flipped on, but then again, that would have made it busted. Or not busted, but definitely an Apex War from out for sure. It is definitely one of the best defaulters in the game, by far. But yeah, this is a slow kill. A very slow one at that, I really hope I'm able to uh, kill him before the timer goes out, actually. <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, let's do this. 
you turn die, you turn die. But yeah, I wonder when the regular single strike Yoshifu is getting banned, which will be in this January. I wonder if this Yoshifu is gonna be a lot more showcased. It wouldn't surprise me as it still is a good mod, it just isn't as good as the other one. So yeah, as always guys, if you're watching, make sure to of course leave a like and subscribe and whatnot, and I'll see you as always in the next video. And to Pao, or Pato, I wanna say very much GG. Phenomenal start, really, really stressed me out. Don't do that again. <laughs> okay, so take care.